Hello guys, welcome to Java into equation series. This is Naveen here once again. So guys, uh, in the previous session we have seen that okay, how to swap uh, two integer variables. Now today we will see that okay, how to swap a uh, two string variables. Okay, because in string variables we cannot perform any arithmetic operation. Okay, guys. So how to swap it? So let's see. I have two strings. Let's see string. Um, let's see a is equal to hello. Okay and string b is equal to world okay i have these two string variables and let's say i print on the console that uh, i'll write before okay before swapping okay so the before swapping okay and in the next line what i'll write system dot out dot print ln a and system dot dot print ln b so if i print on the console simple it's printing on the console the before swapping the value of a is equal to hello and b equal to world so i'll write like this uh, simple i'll write like this the value of a is plus a and uh, i'll print them on the console like this so that i can print in a systematic way the value of b is colon plus b okay if i print like this before swapping the value of a is hello and the value of b is world what i want the value of a the output should be the value of a will be world and b will become hello so how will you do that okay it's a very very important interview question guys how will you do that so what i'll do only three steps i'll perform the first step is simple append a and b okay i'll append a string and b string both and simple store into a okay so a is equal to i'll write a plus b right so a plus b it means a a will become hello world a plus b means hello world so hello world will be will be stored into a so a will become hello world now the second step i'll use that what is the second step i'll use that is store initial string a in okay I'll simple write store. I'll tell you what exactly we have to do. Initial string a in string b. So what exactly I'm gonna do? Initial okay. B is equal to I'll write now. See a dot because a is the okay. A is the full string. Hello world. So what I want from this particular because i want that b should be hello so from this particular long string i'll just capture only hello okay so how exactly i'll do that so i'll use substring method a b is equal to a dot substring okay i'll want to start my beginning index my be beginning index will be zero okay because substring means from where exactly you want to capture the substring so i want to start from zero it means from here this is zero right zero one two three four something like this and ending index is okay what is your end index so the total index is that a dot length okay minus b dot whatever the length is there b dot length so what is a dot length a dot length will be the total number of characters are variable the okay the hello world the length of hello world is this okay minus b dot length okay what is the value of b b is world okay three plus two five minus b dot length so it will exclude this particular world and it will give only hello okay so b will become hello now the third step will be the third step will be what exactly i have to do that is store initial b in string a simple store initial okay a string b in string a so again what i'll do simple now again a is equal to a dot substring what will be my beginning index my beginning index in that case up to b dot length because b is hello now okay so what exactly my beginning index will be simple b dot length b dot length and i don't want ending index simple okay a dot like this and simple i'll print system dot dot print ln the value of a 
the value of let's see i'll write like this a and b after swapping okay the system dot out print ln i'll write simple simple the value of these things i'll print okay so simple these three things let first run this program let's see it's working or not so for initially a is hello b is world let's see now a should be world and b should be hello let's see okay so see initially a is hello b is world and after swapping a is world now and b is hello now okay so let's debug this code so i'll put a debug on 17th line a debugger point just double click on it right click debug as java application okay so it will come over here and i'll move okay step by step i'll just press f6 so what is the value of a a is c a is hello world a will become hello world okay and a dot substring of a dot length minus b dot length okay so a dot length will be okay a dot length will be this this particular length minus b dot length and please start from zero so zero to it will take only from here to here h to o only okay so if you check a dot length the value of a dot length just some simple select this particular syntax right click okay and you can check like this watch see a dot length is 10 okay and what is b dot length b dot length is right click simple watch b dot length is 5 so 10 minus 5 it will become 5 so whatever the value is avail available from 0 to 5 okay so it will start from here 0 1 2 3 4 5 like this so it a will become okay b will become hello right so in that case b will become hello so the moment you execute this particular line let's see what is the value of b b is hello now right right b is hello now again what is the value of a from this particular a this particular string again sub string b dot length so in sub string there are two parameters either you can pass two parameters and you can pass one parameter also that sub string of b dot length okay the sub string of b dot length means saying the beginning index the b dot length is now what is the value of b b is hello right b is hello so it will be 0 1 2 3 4 okay so ultimately let's see what is the length b dot length is 5 0 to 4 it means 5 characters are there so length will be 5 okay so please start from 5 so it will start from here so it will pick till end of the string okay so the moment i execute this particular line so a will become world okay so it will exclude hello from here and after that i'm just printing it on the console world and hello okay so before swapping a is hello b is world after swapping a is world b is hello this is what we have to do so by using substring method we can do that okay we cannot perform any arithmetic operation over here we have to first merge it we have to append it okay and create a full long string and append it into a a equal to a plus b and then b equal to a dot substring 0 to a dot length minus b dot length why minus because a dot length is greater than b dot length so obviously i have to sub subtract b dot length from a dot length and then a dot a is equal to a dot substring and now i have to start my counter from b dot length and i know that b is hello okay so b dot length will be 5 so i'll start from here up to end of this particular string so a will become world now simple okay the substring will return a small string from a long string that's the purpose of substring okay so this is a very famous interview question guys how will you swap okay two string variables without using third variable i'm i'm not using any third variable with using third variable again that the way we did in integer case you can do that okay similarly you can do that but okay without using third variables without using any temporary variable this is a solution for that okay so please practice one or two times at a time of interview don't forget this particular thing okay what exactly the concept what exactly the logic logic is very very important in that case guys otherwise because they won't give you so much amount of time they will give you hardly two to three minutes or five minutes for the, um, not five minutes exactly only two minutes and three minutes within two three minutes you have to give the answer if you're facing face to face okay if you're facing uh, a telephonic hardly they will give you one or two minutes and immediately you have to give the answer for that okay so please practice and let me know if you have any issues and let me know if you have any other solution also in the comment section you can write it over there 
okay so thanks for watching and please subscribe to the channel guys and uh, please watch there are a lot of java interview questions i have written around around seven to eight interview questions i have already i have already uploaded okay so please go through those videos and please prepare your java interview questions also and as well as guys please go through the complete java playlist okay before jumping into these java questions so there are 15 videos are available on okay there are the, these are the 15 videos some are available. functionality some code is available okay these are the 15 videos are available if you really want to improve your java skills please refer these 15 videos at least okay and then move to selenium interview questions and then move to uh, java interview questions and all okay so thanks for watching and let me know if you have any issues thank you so much guys